I'm in Fortnite. Kinda. You see, Fortnite added an NPC that gives out free ice creams, as well as the rarest weapon in the entire game. But he's almost impossible to find. So let's get hunting. First game started off pretty well. I decided to land at one of my favorite POIs, Brutal Bastion. And after taking out a few people off spawn, I knew that this was going to be a good game. But our mission isn't to eliminate people. We need to find the McCreamy NPC. So I wasted my gold hiring this NPC and I got moving. I didn't realize how many people I was going to have to eliminate to try and find this NPC, but people just kept coming and coming and coming and coming and yep yeah, you get the point then i picked up the soaring sprints perk which is going to come in very handy once again i have no idea where all these players are coming from but i'm going to take them all out what like can someone please explain what is happening here what let's put you out of your misery all right i don't know where you think you're running to buddy we were eliminating player after player and exploring most of the map okay that guy does not want to get eliminated Things were looking good, but there was no sign of the NPC anywhere. That's when I stumbled upon this, another rift event that is not the one that we're looking for. As you can see, I was quite mad. So mad that I just started blasting my pistol as much as I could. Except for this guy. He got the thunder shotgun. I was very, very mad. That was until I saw this bad boy, the dub shotgun. Which when you combine with the soaring sprints perk that I was talking about earlier, yeah, things get just a little bit ridiculous. I'm already 1,300 meters in the sky by Fortnite. And I was not coming down under any circumstances. I literally just left my duo down on the ground to fend for himself. When I reached over 2,000 meters in the sky, I started to get a little bit worried. I didn't want to lose this game. Not finding that NPC, this game really took its toll. All right, 3,200 meters in the sky. Uh, somehow not dead. Uh, I'm coming down very shortly. Okay, I'm coming down. It was at this point I realized how high I really was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna be a while, by the way. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, no, nah, it's all good. <laughs> yeah, that's a nice view up here, at least. I'm just falling really slowly, like really slowly. Oh, no, you, you take your time, you take your time. Yeah, no, I'll, yeah, I'll, like, I'll, I'll be there in a second. I'm um, not currently in a 1v2 in a Doors game, you know. I, I would really not like my teammate to come back down to Earth or anything. Oh, that's actually kind of convenient then, because I'm not going to be there for another 2,000 meters. Nice. Uh, that's one dead. 1,700. I'm just very slow, but it's a slow process to get down here, but it's happening. Uh, I'm definitely on my way. 1,000 meters. Yep, I'm slowly 700. Uh, almost there. Yep, <laughs> almost, just really close. <laughs> Yeah, I see him. 300. Okay, he's, he's, he's just chilling. Yep, really close. Oh, yeah, I see him. Um, it's going to be a tough one, but we will try. This guy is just as confused as I am. <laughs> Damn it. So close. Attempt number two was going pretty smooth until my duo died. And after calling him a noob multiple times, it was time for the epic clutch, which, to be honest, did not start off very well at all. Um, yeah. But I'm a genius, and if you think I need health, you are sadly, sadly mistaken. <laughs> no way that worked! This is the game, I'm telling you, everything is going perfectly. I was feeling on top of the world. I felt like I could achieve anything. Yo, 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 what's up, man? That was until I was humiliated more than I've ever been humiliated in my entire life before. Look at them, they're literally laughing at me while I'm on the ground. What just happened to you? But just like I clutched up, guess what? So did my buddy. Kind of, not really. Needless to say, things weren't looking great, so we had to step up our game a bit. You need to tell me where Little Whip is right now. I was starting to get very, very impatient. I had searched the Fortnite map multiple times, and still there was no sign of this NPC. Just a bunch of people trying to stop us from completing our mission. Not gonna happen. Yes, I do understand that the rocket launchers may have been a little bit overkill, but at this point, I was way too far gone. And seeing stuff like this, <laughs> which isn't even close to what I'm looking for. It, it didn't help at all. I'll just say that much. Do you understand what playing Fortnite for 24 hours straight does to a human being? It's not, it's not good. Why would a wholesome campfire that isn't uh, the Lil Whip NPC? It'd be a shame if someone ransacked the entire thing and left you guys with nothing at all. Needless to say, the more games that I played, the more insane that I was getting. Wins and victory royales were coming in like I'd never seen before. But no matter how hard I looked and how much I searched, there was not a single ice cream in sight. And I was getting hungry. So that's when I came up with the best idea ever. I needed to be able to see the entire Fortnite map. It's literally the only way I'm gonna find this NPC. <laughs> 
How do I even go that hard? I haven't seen this one. Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm still going! Oh my god! Then I realized something. I can stay up here for a very long time. Aerial is perfect. Oh, this is about to be dumb. <laughs> this is kind of beautiful. Like, so how long is am I, am I going to be up here for? Little did I know how long it would really be. Yeah, I did a pretty big oopsie. There's 17 people left, and I've still got a very long time before I hit the ground. Dude, how am I still alive? Top 10, baby. Let's go. Not looking good for me. Not looking good for the big creamy. It's sky basing up. I finally landed after 20 minutes and there's only five people left. And despite being able to literally see the entire Fortnite map, I still was unable to find the ice cream man. I was very quickly losing all hope. And if I got emoted on one more time, I was going to lose my mind. I tried absolutely everything. I even tried changing my skin. <laughs> It was getting to a point where I literally lost count of how many games I'd played and how many times I'd stumble upon a rift that wasn't the one I wanted. Epic has to be trolling me at this point. That's it, I'm done. Are you kidding me? Another game, another fail. These victory royales mean nothing to me right now. I was starting to go insane. Look at me, I'm trying to impulse this guy for some reason. I've been playing Fortnite for about 24 hours straight and I feel like I've got absolutely nowhere. We started to lose track of our mission by spawning in so many fish that it blew up a kid's computer. All right, that's it. I'm crashing his computer. Oh, oh, oh wait. Oh my God, my school oh, flagging. Oh, look at all oh, the fish. Look at that, he crashed. He crashed. He crashed. He crashed. He crashed. That is unreal. Well, that's win number five million. Scratch that. Five million and one. Two. Uh, five, five million and two. Yeah, things are starting to get a little bit out of hand. Please. Please. Oh, I hate you. You're not the ice cream man and you never will be. We must be getting close. You can't hide forever, Lil Whip. 360. Boom. <laughs> Tell me where Lil Whip is. Tell me where he is. Now. Tell me. I need to know. Please. Three, two, one. <laughs> I was starting to really enjoy having fun on Fortnite and just playing normally. And that's when this happened. Because at this point, I'd basically given up on the mission. We took out the people trying to eliminate us one by one and everything was going good. I, I was finally having fun again. And as we were riding off into the sunset, oh, there's a rift. A rift spawned basically right next to us. Like Epic had put it there on purpose. Oh! I scream! Oh my god! <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> finally, after a million Fortnite games, I'd finally gotten my hands on some ice cream. The ice creams don't heal that much, but I think Epic Games put this in the game for a reason. Because this silly little ice cream man and these silly little ice creams in my inventory are the reasons why I've enjoyed playing Fortnite so much over the past few days. <laughs> oh my god, I can't believe it. Now, instead of letting him die to the zone, I'm gonna put him out of his misery, take his weapon, which by the way is the rarest weapon in the entire game, and do what needs to be done. But then I realized something. Over the past few days i've got more wins than i ever wanted so you know what i'm gonna do the right thing by making this kid's day and giving him his first Fortnite win do it yes do it <laughs> nice <laughs> oh my god we did it <laughs> he literally had no elims so i'm in Fortnite. Kinda. Because next time you see the silly little ice cream man giving out free ice creams, I want you to think of me and do something nice. 